Hello. Welcome back to Alan Wake 2. We're in the Poet Cinema with our adoring fans. It's actually not a lot of people now that I look at it. Anyway. Um. Yeah. We're trying to figure out how to progress. I'm not entirely sure yet. Also hoping nobody in the audience suddenly attempts to strike me. Okay, so we've kind of checked out the cinema and the stage when we transition areas. Is there maybe anything up here? Oh, we can take the whole light. Oh, and there's a door here. Oh my god. Really didn't explore the space that much. Also, as long as nobody here is attacking me. Uh... Alexi Kesa. That, that's obviously Alex Casey. <laughs> I was editing the video and as soon as I saw that, like, immediately, immediately I was like, oh, that's supposed to be Alex Casey. Because I'm very good at paying attention. What are those? The cops had gotten their 15 minutes of fame with the cult, and it had been a scream. They were the murder victims. I had to find a way into the projection booth somehow. Did you have to say it like that, though? <laughs> That's a really weird way to put the murder of two people. <laughs> Can I just open it? Dang it. Alright, find a way into the projection booth. He's open. No. Okay. Well, obvious, obvious next step. Whoa, hey buddy. You're leaving? Wake. Wow, you really up. That guy really played it cool. Sorry, Alan. Alan, you were saying something? Cool. Alright. It doesn't seem like much has changed in here. So hopefully that changed this. Oop! No, it's no, the same. I don't know, it seemed weird. Are you open now? Okay, what did that change in here? Trauma pad. Okay, hmm. Let's change the scene in here, maybe. Plug in Cult of the Word. Ooh, yes, please. Oh, that'll probably open it. Following your master awaits you. Following your master into La La Land. A sad bunch of clowns in funny masks and hoods pretending to be a secret society. Maybe it is you who's playing a role, Mr. Casey. A role carefully laid out for you. A puppet blindly performing the ritual steps for the glory of the cult. Huh? What the fuck have you been smoking? Nightless night. A clip of the lost film survived. You will see, Mr. Casey. In the Nightless Night, you will finally see. Nightless Night was Zane's film. It played a role in this story. Cool. Will this open the projection booth? No. It just adds these nice walls. Okay, yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing. It's weird that that room doesn't seem to do very much. That guy coming for me? Ha! Ah! Ok. 
God, it's so hard to tell sometimes. Ooh! Somebody else here. Is it you? God. Learn to aim. Oh! Don't be a dick. What about the other one? There you are. Okay, I think we're good. <laughs> um, yeah, let's heal. Maybe use one of the pads. Yeah, that does quite a bit more. Don't want a full heal because shining our flashlight on people heals us. Okay. Now that I feel safe in this environment. Clip of the lost film. The light projected a teaser of dark secrets. Okay. I mean, ugh, sorry. I mean, in that film, it felt like. Okay, wow, yeah, that door's completely gone. Okay, I think we need the light from here. And are we maybe, like, giving it to him on the screen? Zane's lamp on the screen had no light. Yeah. I could transfer the light in my lamp to his. Here you go, man. The light of the lamp shone out of the screen and revealed the door. Oh. Interesting. Now I'm awake. I do kind of want to see what the lobby looks like when I plug this in. If it'll let me go there. Just want to fully explore the environment. Or write the environment, whatever. Clip of the lost film. The secret truths waited in the film Nightless Night. Ooh. The scene changed with the story. Oh, that locks me out of the theater, though. <laughs> Oops. Let's me leave. Not gonna, though. A film that was a ritual, literal movie magic, in a theater that hailed from a time when there was still magic in the silver screen. <laughs> Although that top part is in English now, the heat of the murder was like a crown burning on his brow. Huh. Uh, nope, this one. Hopefully him with that lamp will just keep them all at bay. Ooh, is that a big W? Out that in the night. Back out into the night. The seedy alley away from prying eyes was a good scene for dark deeds. Hell yeah. And has got a big W. Or M. Okay, quick save. I think my inventory's good. Dark board. Is my inventory good? Uh, I don't really know what else I'd put in here. Yeah, we're good. May I leave this way? Okay, we got that creepy thing. I probably can't. God, that, oh, that chilled me a little. What are we looking for? 
other than just a way into the projection booth. I can figure this out on the plot board. Oh yeah, well, we'll get there, we'll get there. You're probably locked. Oh, that probably leads to the other door that's upstairs. Okay. I mean, I kind of want to see where we are on the map first. Oh, this is the back lot. This isn't... No. I was hoping this was going to be like a film studio back lot. That's a shame. Ooh, are we only getting three scenes? The cult dumps their trash here? The cult of the word. The cultists were driven by mad fanatical belief. Whoa, okay. Something happened over here? So far it looks like nothing's changed. all the help I can get or can fit in my pockets <laughs> not much all right I really can't tell what changed here Should I, like, slide a flashbang down there? <laughs> okay. Plot board. New York's finest. The cops had sold their souls. Hey. Hey, police car. Not important to the story. Uh, somewhat. Think they're gonna want us to, like, cut off a finger or something for this initiation, do you? Nah, I'm sure we'll just chant some ceremonial stuff. N nothing to it. Well, it's about time. We paid our dues. Made plenty of their problems disappear. Dumped all those nobodies down that chute. Oh. What we did or didn't do, it's all behind us now. We're going straight to the top, partner. Yep, like we died and went to heaven. <laughs> cool cops. Oh, there's a thing there. How do I get to that? I want to be in there. Hey, we'll take this, though. I was making progress. Interesting, interesting. And then put it back. This kind of feels like a way forward now that I look at it. Let me just take this. I do want to check out the final scene. Clip of the lost film. The film was made to be played in a place like this. I imagine not much is going to change. My writing was affecting reality. Yeah, okay. It's just the truck dropping off stuff. In the city trapped in eternal night, they watch the film where the night never arrives, where the night hides in your mind. So it's kind of a dayless night here. Okay, well... As expected, that didn't do very much. Go back in here, find Alice. Look it back in. And up we go. Who knows, probably leads to the basement. Now just open it delicately. We're now above the whole thing. Okay. Bullets. 
Let me just equip my normal gun. Actually, let's reload. <gasps> Keys? Straight to the top. The dirty cops look down in the city. Their city. They had committed repulsive deeds to get there. They told themselves it was worth it. Oh, there's a ladder. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, we're going to go through all the words again up here. Hey. Something about this area puts me at ease. Or the opposite. I'm just picking up. I'm just finding so much stuff I can't have. Hopefully it's not that important. Okay, but this line, is that pointing towards a word? Sure is, maybe. Word of stuff? Isn't that literally the one I need? Oh my god, yes. Give it to me. Boom. Now give these to me. And just all the other stuff I didn't pick up along the way. This whole area seems like it's set up for an arena for fighting. Like all these different vantage points. Breaker? It was locked from the other side. Breaker, if you're in there, you better open this door. Probably in there. Oh, and a way down. Oh. I want to hang out with my friend. Yeah, I'll just put some of the stuff away. I'm not carrying any flashbangs, am I? Yeah, okay, I guess. I've got the room for it. Just gotta find the right moment. What are we doing? Could maybe change the scene and get a different view of this? Because it's letting me change it from up here. No. I'm just wondering if maybe those echoes only appear in certain versions of the world. Someone oh. informed to the yep. death from the rooftop. Don't you fucking move, or I'll blow you away. You got me, Mr. Casey. I'm all yours. Go ahead. Ask that bird question. How did you do it? How did you get me into that film clip without my remembering it? Talk to me, damn it! You've seen the film? Good, good. Now you're ready to meet the Grand Master. He's waiting for you in the projection booth where everything will be revealed. Where he will project a new reality onto this one. And now, Mr. Casey, I've played my part to the end. No, no, no! Crazy bastard! Why'd he jump? The projection booth. Was that where I find the murder site? Fun. Fun. I mean, the projection booth and the sort of 
power that they're giving. It's sort of similar to the slide projector and control. The Grand Master, he waited inside. His presence felt out in the night. Maybe a lot of adoring fans out here. That changed the story. And with that, the dark place changed. Doesn't look great. It's kind of dismal now. All right. Okay. Is that door going to be open? I mean, I... I heard somebody do one of those moves. Come on, open, open, open. Gah! It be opened on the side. Where is it exactly? God, where am I? <laughs> okay, here. Uh, like, looks like there's another way in here. I don't know if I have a way of getting there. Yeah, this it's gonna be full of people who want to kill me now, isn't it? Uh, it's a number of them, isn't it? You? Do you want to fight? No? You seem unaffected. No, he's been affected. Didn't even have to look. God, I don't know where we are. Back off. Okay, let's reload that so I have it for next time. Okay, looks like it was low on ammo on one of these guns. I don't know what happened there. Oh well. I also just am not seeing a way forward, so I'm assuming I just have to walk all the way back around. Oh, it is grim here now. Oh yeah, obviously my door would be gone. Um, This one, New York's finest. Door, please. Thank you. Boy, it's hard remembering all these realities. Can I have that back. Or do I have it? It's so hard to tell sometimes <laughs> if I have a light or don't have a light. Uh, oh, okay. Well, I can't. Oh, hey. Didn't see y'all there. Trying to get in the hole? You let me shoot him. Thank you for so kindly waiting your turn. You just climb out of there? Okay, you guys don't attack me while I change the story again. Uh, I don't actually know which one's going to get me back inside. Okay, maybe a version without any modifications. Okay. No, maybe I didn't. There weren't stairs here, and I just sort of dropped down. Okay. Hmm. Or maybe... 
Ugh, no. Grandmaster would make the most sense for letting me back inside. I'm not going in there, though. Let's just, let's just go in here for a second. Oh, wow. Missed these. Okay. Just heal ourselves up real quick. Okay, glad I came in here. Now, are we sliding down that hole? I have room for you now. God, this all sucks. What? So am I not allowed down there? I don't really know what's happening anymore. Oh! Screw you. You knife too much! You knife too much! Okay, this time, we're going in with a flare gun. Where are you? Is that just an instant win? Nope. What about that time? What the hell's happening? Is the flare gun just useless against that guy, or does the flare gun only work when their shields are gone? Which feels contradictory because it's a very bright light source. Screw y'all, I'm going inside. Okay. I feel safer. Oh god, they're just climbing out of the vents now. Literally. Pop some of those. Okay, I swear you guys weren't there a second ago. I'm just going to assume I'm safe. I'm going to plug the Grandmaster into here. God, just everybody. Every single person. I can't see. God damn it. Okay, at least you aren't being very aggressive. I can just politely shoot you in the face. Again. Not much changed here other than it's just darker. Let's pop another one of these. Do I have any refills? No, uh... No, merge the... Can I only hold four at once? Weird, I thought I could hold five. Uh, and we kind of chewed through our signal flare. I think that's as good as it's going to get. We're all reloaded on everything. <laughs> cool. Oh, Jesus! Going to the theater. I don't think I want to summon the Grandmaster, but. <sighs> Grandmaster. Grandmaster's Dark Invitation. The scene here had changed. 
Hello, tiny sir. Get up to the projection booth. Wake. Interesting. Meet the Grandmaster in the projection booth. Wake. What happens if I go to meet you on the st You're just a projection, so I can't meet you. Um I found myself in a maze of film equipment. There had to be a way to the projection booth from here. I wasn't alone. Hello? You show him. Not loving the almost black and white. No, it's visible. It just lights up more. The color, I mean. Back where I started. Yeah. A loop within a loop. I had to keep going. Is this a. I'm here, you son of a bitch. Show yourself. Who, who was it? Who said that? The grand mask of my hands. You're a clown in a mask. I'm not the one wearing a mask here, you moron. He's having an argument with himself. It's like he's looping too, but he doesn't realize it. The Casey in the story was losing it. I wasn't far behind. God damn it. Oh. Well. Ugh, yeah. I was back at the beginning again. I had to keep going. Find a way to the murder site. I'm here, you son Hello? Of a bitch. Hey! Show yourself! Who, who was it? Who said that? That's a it's gone. But I saw someone. You can run, but you can't hide. God, all the sounds. Oh my god, <laughs> I am on edge. <sighs> well. Room change. It was locked from the other side. I swear the door was near. I was back at the beginning again. I had to keep going. Find a way to the murder site. <laughs> I don't like it in here. Casey? 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 Who's there? <laughs> Look, you got the wrong guy. 
I'm not Alex Casey. I only play him in the movies. He's just a fictional character. What? what what's going on here? I swear. You don't have to kill me. It's the Sam Lake. You don't have to go get that knife and stab me. You can just give up and go back. Forget about the ritual sacrifice to open the way forward. The ritual sacrifice to open the way? No! Don't do it! You don't have to become a monster! Just leave the knife where it is, in the back, and go! A knife in the back? Everything about this was absurd. Our dialogue forced and ridiculous. In desperate need of another pass. <laughs> play along to see where it took me. Oh no! Oh no you don't! You'll be sorry! <laughs> this is a bit exaggerated. Yeah. Fuck. Fair enough. I don't blame him. Well, I have the knife. That means I have to walk slowly towards him. That's just safety. Even Michael Myers knows that. What? Is this Coffee World? I was getting close. Is this where we overlapped with her when she went in the well? Come, Alex Casey. You've done well. You've played your role perfectly. Everything out of your mouth is a damn lie. The only place any of this makes any sense is in your psychotic brain. As a fictional character in a story, you've fulfilled your purpose. You've brought the writer of the story here. You can go now, Casey. No, 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 I'm not going anywhere before I get some answers. How was I in that movie? How, why does all this feel so familiar? What? Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck am I? No! And welcome to you, Alan Wake. What the hell? This is the ritual to lead you on. We are just one step away from your final destination, Mr. Wake. But first, here's an unanswered mystery for you. If Casey was fictional, and you assumed his role as a detective. Are you now fictional too? Whose story are you living? Mr. Wake. The visions are getting under my skin. Coming too close for comfort. Not a separate layer, but mingling with my own reality in the dark place. Projection booth. This is a bit of a roundup way to get here. Wait. Dead end. This can't be right. Did I miss something? Do we go back? Okay, we got color again at least. It's our Wizard of Oz moment. The murder site. Oh. That's some messed up shit. <laughs> the mask was the key. Oh. So kind of like how we passed the record on to her from the bathtub in the hotel. This is going to pass the mask on. All right, so we're overlapping in reverse, I guess. And the, the, the sunken bunker and the hotel is kind of where they met in the middle, I guess. Okay, well, let's send her the mask. This is how I could help her. Wait. Something's 
Saga Anderson, listen. I I've been tricked. Scratch wrote returned. I, I tried to fix the story, but he stopped me before I reached the end. He has it now. It's the key to escape. What do you mean, escape? You mean with Scratch? I need to stop him. I need to stop him before he gets out. He's after Alice. I'm still trapped, but I'm making progress. I wrote you in to be the story's hero. Scratch made a horror story. I need to match the genre. It has to be dark, but the hero can break through, save her family, save us all. Save her family? Are you talking about my family? Yes. Whatever you're doing, it's working. You just need to keep going. Did we have family in the horror story? Closer now. Closer than ever before. But there was no time to lose. Everything was hanging in the balance. I could still lose it all. Parliament Tower. I had to make it work this time. I could stop Scratch, get the manuscript, fix its ending. End of part. I always skip those songs at the end of chapter, but I do recommend seeking those out online. I was listening to a few of them a few days ago. And they're pretty good. I was traveling deeper into the dark place. The poem on the wall was growing at the same pace, dogging my footsteps. Like my unwanted shadow moving in the corner of my eye. It wasn't my writing. I didn't know what it was. A terrible prophecy, a curse, looming over me. A pale balloon in the sky, float and sink deeper. Night springs when bright falls. For this sleeper, the surface disturbed, the reflection now a traitor, and the cavity of the skull turned to a crater. This is the ritual to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you are gone. Spooky stuff. Can we get our flashlight back? Thank you. Are these open now? No. Figured. In a poem he told us, he once mistook an ocean for a lake. Oh, I can't read it this fast. Wandering in the shadows under a dark ocean, forever searching for a way into the light to his love. Nightless Night, a Thomas Zane movie. Alex Casey is the detective. Barbara Yeager is the writer's widow. Ilmari Hutari is the murderer. Otti is the janitor. Thomas Zane is the writer, Alan Wake. Music by Otti and the janitors.
Onko täällä ketään? Ahti. Sanovat, se joka varjoon tyytyy, valon ihmeestä paitsi jää. Uutiset mistään paluusta ovat ennenaikaisia. Tulin vain käymään. Ja nyt kun muistan, millaista tämä touhu täällä on, en viivy kauaa. Missä veljesi luuraa? Pisti hengiltä. Rupes käymään aivoa se aina länkytys. Uurilla ja mestarilla. Mutta ei se paskaveli kelvan edes siihen. Sä olit mestarin valittu. Vaikka mä koskaan ymmärtänyt, että miksi. Päiviltä pitäisi sinutkin pistää. Super rapinat, poika. Leikataan parta! Leikataan pojalta parta! Miksi palasit? Kun kerran lähdit? En aikonut, mutta nyt löydän itseni täältä. Nyt on kai kirottu, kirjoitettu sadistisen kirjailijan tarina. Kierän kehää. Maa on syklinen laulu. Miten siellä valtion kontrollivirastossa menee? Väärä virasto. En ole siellä töissä. Sitä paitsi. Sain potkut. Ei olisi tarvetta talonmiehen apulaiselle. Ei ole. Tämän tilan isäntä katosi yön selkää vuosia sitten. Sen jälkeen, kun sinä lähdit. 
merkit on ilmassa, että multakin loppuu hommat pian. Siksi kyselen virastosta. Ehkä saan sieltä töitä. Malja. Mille juomme? Yöttämälle yölle. Sanotaan, että Aleen kurkotti liian pitkälle yön syövereihin. Eikä löytänyt sieltä enää pois. Kannattaa varoa sitä Aleenin mustaa leskeä. Taisit olla vähän heikkona häneen. Pelkäsin häntä. Me pojat oltiin aina vähän toivottomia naisten kanssa.
tämä riitti vie sinut tuon puoleiseen. Hän palaa. Et sinut lukitaan huoneessa. En kierrä kehää. Tämä on spiraali. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't expecting to get the whole thing. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. We've now run long accidentally. <laughs> we will be back on Monday. I... Yeah, we're heading to Parliament Tower. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. And until then, I hope you have a good weekend. And goodbye. Kasvot piilouvut.